number two, I already took the package over with my trusty letter opener. All right. Okay, and then these packs there should be a promo. Woohoo! Oh, sweet. Okay, we got the Kurgar of the Hordes for this one. That's much better. It's actually fantastic. Happy about that. I, I like him as why, in case anyone was wondering. Like, I'm not really a green player, but I think he has merit. Alright, in this one, I'm just going to go over the rares, since I kind of showcased some of the other stuff in the last video. So, this will be much quicker. But I don't drop anything. Okay, we got an ensnare. Sorry, I'm just trying to adjust to give you guys the best angle. I care about my subscribers, so. And this one's being stubborn. Well, that means there's something good in it. Nope, just uh, this blocker. Alright, that's our second word, the Queen Tanawa. Okay, for this we got a Dragon's Breath and a Dreadclaw. So that's our first foil. That's another rare. If you guys want anything, let me know in the, the comments or PM me. So, I'll, I'll look to trade. Okay, we got this Patchwork Surgeon. Okay, a Gemini Dragon. As far as the Firebirds go and other extra stuff, we have play sets of most of the things we're looking for. So if you guys need any of those, let me know because we have those. Ah, stupid pack. Okay, we got a Dragon of Reflections and another Infernus. So I guess that's okay. Really wanted Andromeda, but I guess beggars can't be choosers. Maybe we'll get lucky still. At least would like another Lyra. Maybe we should. Okay, so Dauntless Tusker. Maybe I should uh, be like, hey, cards, give me something, you know. Like, please. Oh, boy. Sorry, I'm a little tired. Queen Tanawa. It's up real late and like I always am. I think around 4, 4.30 a.m. And then I don't know why I normally am not awake at like 10 a.m. Or for some reason I was this morning. <clears throat> and I heard the mail truck pull up. So I was happy about that. Okay, I'm cool with that. This looks like a lot of our last box, but you know. So we have a Kendrix, which is really good, and then this Patchwork Surgeon. I actually really like Kendrix, so I mean that would be probably be the favored dragon I would run. Lyra is a dragon I am running, so if I get more of her or him, whatever it is. Oh, okay, Spellbane Dragon. This guy is ridiculous, I personally think. So I'm really glad to see him there. I'm not gonna lie, a guy seems absurdly powerful to me. It's it's very very much fits into what red green should do. Okay, this Reaper, which I don't really care about. Alright, last side. Okay, we got, ooh, not the worm, another Spellbane Dragon, yes, it makes a play set, 
And we got this untamed guy for a foil. Okay, another surgeon. So if anyone's after those, we have enough of them and we're not using them as far as I know. Just something for everyone out there to note. <laughs> Another Reaper. Okay. Uh, if anyone's wondering, I have a real beef with Reaper. There's two things that they could have done to make the card really playable. <clears throat> Pardon me. And they didn't either. The first is, is make it so you get to choose what card, like on your opponent's side, to destroy. The other is uh, they could have gave him Double Breaker. Okay, so we got a Herald, which is okay. We got another Kendrix, which like I said, I'm perfectly fine with that. I think that makes a play set now. So it's real good. I'm definitely going to look into trying and using that now. In our Dragon deck. And I say R because my fiance likes the dragons, so I'm going to try and make that work for her. So one of those guys. Not sure how many foils I have left. I didn't. I haven't been counting this time. Not as focused on this one. Okay, we got a dragon of reflections. The guy with shield shift. Kind of a cool idea, actually. I, th I really think it's unique. Might build blue dragons myself. I don't know yet. We'll see. Yes! There we go, guys. There it is. It's not for trade. Unless I somehow can get two Orion for it. These guys are like 40 some dollars. There's Andromeda. I'm very happy about that. That is beautiful pull. Fantastic. And then we also got Harold alone in that same pack. That was a good pack. Just overall, not just because of Harold, but like it came with, you know, two evolutions and stuff like that in there. So there's Andromeda. I'm happy. That that made this box so much better. Okay, I'm cool with that. So we have a Ragefire Tetsurion, and we have this Hornblade Dragon. A few packs left. Sorry, the whole thing moved. Okay, we got this pod. That probably no one cares about. At least I feel that way. Uh, give me a moment. I'm going to get some of this out of here. Normally better at that, but... All right. We got a foil and... Oh, neat. Okay, I'm cool with that. It's all the frozen wastes. That's pretty good. And then we got this other Dauntless Tusker, which is really good in... I, I think I know what kind of dragon deck we're going to be building. That's, that's really good. Like it's starting to really shape up what deck I want to make. There we go, Bottle of Wishes. I, like I said, I'm not personally after it, but I know a lot of people that are, so. I may use it, I don't know yet. I mean, it just, it doesn't seem that appealing to me, personally. Okay, Gemini Dragon. And what's in the last pack, guys? Alright, let's see what we got, and no foil, but uh, we got a Dragon of Reflections. So overall, good boxes. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and yeah, let me know what's going on with you guys out there, and if you guys got any good pulls or anything like that, and I hope you enjoyed this big box opening for Kaijuda Corner, and have a good one, guys. Peace, YouTube, and Zero Magnum X out. Later.